Today I'm going to talk about one of the most powerful medicine when it comes to asthma, bronchitis, upper respiratory tract infection and this is the best considered herb when it comes to bleeding disorders whether it is the Urdhvag Raktapitta bleeding from the nose mouth whether it is Adhog Raktapitta urine anus or Piryak Raktapitta bleeding from the skin which we commonly see in atopic dermatitis in cases of eczema, in cases of psoriasis and those incurable severe skin infections. How this medicine has great results, how Ayurved cures the root cause. We are going to understand in this particular video. Let's talk about Adhatoda Vesika which is known as Malabar Nut in English and known as Vasa in Ayurveda. Namaste everyone, welcome to Jovi's Hospital of Ayurved and Aesthetic Center, Mumbai. We are talking about Vasa. It is known as Adhusa in Hindi and Adhusa in Marathi. In English, we know it by the name of Malabar Nut. If we talk about its properties, it is Tikt Kashai Rasatmak, which is bitter and pungent in taste. It is Sheetavirya, which is it is cool in its potency and mainly used wherever the cuff and pith is prakopit. In these particular doshas are predominant. It is seen, you know, that a couple of years ago there was a allopathy medicine in syrup form which had a combination of bromexin as well as vasa. And over the label, you know, the bottle, there was a label which mentioned with the vasaka effect as marketing. So the FDA then banned this product. And uh, because again, the reason was given that it had a combination of allopathy and herb in one syrup. No idea altogether a different different story whether the FDA was right or wrong. The whole point of sharing this story is that with the Vasaka effect, it says that Vasa is a medicine that is so famous when it comes to upper respiratory tract infection and overall has good results when it comes to even those patients who have asthma since birth, asthma since childhood. Amazing results seen when it comes to Vasa. Vasa is one of the medicine that is one of the Panchatikta, five bitter herbs. Even Acharya Charak, who is the father of medicine in Charak Samvita, mentions Vasa as one of the five bitter herbs. It mentions it in Tikta Skanda Dravyas. Panchatikta Grit, Panchatikta Grit Gugul, Panchatikta Grit Gugul Kashaya, or all the five bitter herbs, its various combinations are available today, used for various different, different purposes. Five bitter herbs. We see Vasa, Nimba, Patol, Kiratikta, which is Kadu Chirayat and Guduchi. Used in combination and again, we all know when it comes to Tikta Kashai Rasatmak Dravyas or Tikta Dravyas, bitter herbs, we see the first use it going towards the skin for curing the skin ailments, the serious conditions when it comes to skin. So, Tikta Dravyas, Sheetavirya is a number one add-on when it comes to such bleeding disorders or skin infections where itching is present, where the swelling is present, where the burning is present. As it is Kapha Pitta Shamak, Pitta Nasti Daha, which is there is no burning sensation without the aggravation of Pitta, hence for burning Vasa. It is said as Kapha Nasti Kandu Shod, for Kandu, for itching, Vasa is best. So these are the simple simple benefits when it comes to Vasa. Let's understand what's mentioned in Bhava Prakash Nigantu about Vasa. It is said as Shwas Kas Jwara Shardi Meha Kushta Shaya Paham which means Shwas for asthma, one of the best. Kas for cough cold, for Shardi which means for vomiting, for Jwar all types of fever. Vasa is very very useful. For Meha which means Prameha it reduces the blood sugar levels naturally. Hence, for diabetic patients, Vasa has to be used under proper care because it reduces the blood sugar levels. It is said as Kushta, we just discussed Kushta, which is skin diseases. It is said as Kushnati Vapu, when it comes to the Vyakhya given for Kushta. Kushnati Vapu, which means the skin is, you know, uh, worse or the skin is smelling. The skin is all, uh, you know, damaged with the infection. In such case, that is said as skin disease, kushta, where vasa is useful. And then there is shay, which means you can say tuberculosis, you can say anemia, you can say weakness. All these three ailments we see vasa is useful. When we do the panchakarma called as vamana, which means the medicated emesis, 
we see when the patient is vomiting at times one in 50 or one in 60 patient we see when the patient the vegas are coming the patient is vomiting we see that one drop of blood comes out or there is a wave of blood immediately when we administer one teaspoon of vasa we see the problem is settled so vasa is one of the emergency medicine as well you can say it is a medicine that is present in the famous proprietary medicine in Ayurveda of Activate India, which is Bronchomed Syrup. Bronchomed Syrup used by doctors worldwide for patients of asthma, cough, cold, fever and many different different ailments. Vasa and Bronchomed Syrup today is present, you know, door to door at home, right from a child to old age, you know, person is using Bronco to strengthen their immune system, to strengthen their respiratory system. So these were some of the benefits of Vasa. It is available, you know, in the juice form, in Gritta form, in tablet form, in powder form. You know, Vasa juice, Vasa Gritta, Vasa the Kalpa, which is syrup form. There is Vasa Churna. There are different, different medicine where Vasa is present, which makes it the best, best one. There have been researches on its anti-ulcer activity, anti-microbial activity and hepatoprotective activity. A proper research article present where Vasa is proven to be effective. It is Pitta Shamak, it is Kapha Shamak. Best for bleeding disorders and best for Shwas and Kas. That is all about Vasa. For females who have prolonged bleeding, who have white discharge, prolonged bleeding, we use Vasa along with Pushyanuk, along with Pravarpishti, Godanti, Kukutta, Andatvag, Pasma. We do make the use of Vasa. Vasa is also a Stambana. So Vasa is used for females who have prolonged bleeding, who have heavy bleeding, who have painful menses. Vasa is used for epistaxis, bleeding from the nose. We've already spoken at the start of the video. For atopic dermatitis, we give Vasa the Grita. We make the Siddha Vasadi Grutta 3 Agni Saunska to make it a really potent one which is very result oriented as compared to those that are easily available in the market. So Vasa Grutta directly consumed or mixed with milk to be taken Abhyantar as the Abhyantar Sneapan. This Grutta reaches to every corner and every Sukshma Strotas and it shows its action. Has beautiful results. The same Grutta in many cases, we use it as an external medicated grita. So, Vasadi grita, teen paki sonskar made by an authentic Ayurvedic practitioner. Vasa grit used externally for psoriasis, for eczema, for conditions like the atopic dermatitis, which is one of the seven types of eczema. We see allergic eczema, which is atopic dermatitis, a very, very severe one. Patients suffer from this since childhood and very commonly seen in children. So, Vasa grit. Vasa Grut Snehaman, Bahya Pratisarad, we see outstanding changes. These are all the benefits of Vasa. Any doubts, any questions, do let us know in the comment section below. Until next time, from Jovis and the team, look impressive, be progressive. <laughs>